more I play Breezy, the more I realize that she's kind of foul-mouthed, and I sort of like that on her. I think it's, it's kind of interesting. And it seems perfectly natural for someone who's raised with four brothers. I don't know. All right, are we ready? Welcome, dear viewers, to Couch Warrior TV on YouTube. I am the Couch Warrior, and this is Unbound Season 2 Let's Play. This video series is the companion to Character Crusade Unbound podcast. And in each episode, we explore Skyrim roleplay concepts and ideas through actual gameplay. Season 2 of the podcast is called The Ghosts of Yore. And our character concept is Breezy Baudelaire, student of the Order of the Divine Scribe. And Wandering Breton. All right. Let's find us a book. Yes. All right, off we go. Which way? Huh? This way. Huh. All right. All right, so Breezy has her radar going here. We're, we're looking for this book, Urag Groshub. Let's talk about Urag Groshub and what kind of boss he might be. <laughs> and what, what Breezy might think of the man. Um, we're all very familiar with Urag. He is um, a very serious Broadcast and abrasive individual. Defense. And I'm guessing just the sort of fella that Breezy might be used to interacting with, or even prefer to interact with for that matter, because she's quite abrasive herself. <laughs> All right. Well, we're getting good at fighting wolves. Who's this? Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? Hey! Maik has heard it is dangerous to be your friend. What? My friend? Why? Who's talking about me? Already? Maik knows why farmers are blind. It has nothing to do with the Dwemer disappearing. Really? Really? What the hell? Dangerous to be my friend. Who says that? Huh. That makes me want to hit F5. <laughs> okay. That's not great. Oh, don't you do it. Why? Animals are insane here. There's another one. Let's get it over with. Gotcha. Why did he say that? That he'd heard it was dangerous to be my friend? How does anyone even know me here? That makes no fluffing sense. All right. Well. Okay. We still on the right track? Okay. This way? Where the hell? Oh, okay. I have to talk to Urag about this spell. It seems not real accurate. Uh-oh. That doesn't look good, does it? 
What is that? Is that a ghost? Shit. All right, look at her. We can take her, right? Hey, careful. Hold it. This here's a toll road, see? You're going to have to hand over, say, 200 gold if you want to use our road. 200 gold? <laughs> you must be off your nut, lady. Uh, listen, I don't have that kind of money. How about you let me through and I don't blast your guts out through your ass? You know, now that I think of it, that sounds fair. <laughs> Just shove off before the others notice. Huh. All right. Well, glad we had this talk. Obviously, she thought better of messing with Breezy Baudelaire. I better get out of here before I push my luck. All right. Okay, where is this leading us? Let's find out, shall we? Uh-oh. I heard that. Ugh. Wolves are everywhere. They're vermin here. All right, so... We're going to find this book, but who knows how long an adventure this is going to be. be interesting to find out, because... Well, I, I do know the map really well. There are a lot of... Traveler! Over here! Oh, shit. How about we have five here? Just in case. <laughs> All right. We better go in cautiously. Uh, yeah... What's going on here? That's close enough, fool. Never should have Now you die. Now I die. Are you kidding? <laughs> what the hell? Hmm. They don't look like monks. Although that looks expensive. I could sell it. Look at that. I like how she did her hair. That seems maybe more manageable than what I'm doing. Huh. All right. Well, you picked on the wrong lady. Look at these poor saps. What the heck. All right, that looks interesting up there, but that is not the direction we're traveling, so I better let it go. So Urag Groshub, he is a tough taskmaster, but I kind of see him as being the sort of individual that Breezy would respond to. And if we, th if we want to try to consider how she might react psychologically as an adult to people of different sorts. It's almost helpful sometimes to imagine what she might have been like as a child. And to me, she sort of strikes me as the sort of person who as a child would have had to have been disciplined with a pretty firm hand in order to get her to do anything. And, uh, you know, when I think of her versus Urag, it almost feels a little bit like, you know, the kind of thing where she might see some similarities between him and perhaps a father figure in her life, either her actual father or a grandfather or someone who is firm with her and set boundaries. <laughs> um, Breezy doesn't like boundaries, but my guess is that Boundaries are something that are beneficial to her, in a way.
Anyway, I guess what I'm getting at is I feel like a personality type like Urag might be the kind of person that she would respond to. So I think this could make for an interesting relationship going forward, having somebody in charge of her who knows how to handle her. And it seems to me that Urag may actually be the sort of guy who knows exactly how to handle someone like her, whereas other people in her past have not, have not been able to figure out what to do with her. So that could be interesting. All right. Well, shit. I really don't want to go swimming. Ugh. Oh, I got nothing now. It has me going straight into the river. Wait, look. It has me going there. There's a cave. That's where it wants me to go. All right. This river is crazy here. Well, I made it onto the island, but maybe I'm just going to have to suck it up, eh? That makes me think I need some kind of... Is there a water walking spell? That'd be pretty cool, wouldn't it? All right, well, there's nothing for it. We gotta do it. All right, cram everything in the backpack. Everything in the backpack. Uh, that's good. That's good. Oh, God. All right. Yeah! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Whoo! That is freezing cold. Okay. What else? Let's put, uh... Well, we can leave the hood off for now. Alright, so... Yeah, she had to make the dip. Didn't really have a choice. So we got the book holder, we got the backpack. Break out her coat. She's gonna wear her big coat to get warmed up. Okay. Didn't know I was gonna have to go in a cave. That's the worst. So Breezy doesn't necessarily care for places like caves and barrows. She knows it's a necessary evil. But she likes being out in the world where she feels like she has more command over her environment. Um, kind of a sense of vulnerability in enclosed spaces. Okay, okay. Oh shit, this looks bad. This looks really bad. Disgusting. All right, well, we better get serious. Shit. Why? Okay. Shit. Ok. 
Okay, here it comes, here it comes. a lot of them. Okay. What? God. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ugh. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. Okay. How about... Let's set a little trap here. Oh, come on. All right. Ward's not going to help me against spitting venom. Oh, look at that. I got two with one shot. That worked out great. Ooh. What do you suppose the range is on this gust, huh? Oh, yeah. Come on, you bastards. I got your number. Got your number. Breezy's got your number. Mostly. Oh, God, there's so many. Ugh, gross. All right, hang on. Hang on. Regroup. Regroup. Oh, right in the face. Oh, this isn't working. Now we're talking. Oh god, there's more. Okay, all right, all right. All right, where am I? What's going on? Ugh. Oh, it just keeps going. There had better be some fluffing books in here. I'm going to be pissed. Look at that. It's disgusting. Hey, I wonder. Eh, I'm not going to risk it. All right, here we go. Yeah. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Hey, what's going on? Okay, here we go. Come on now. Man, I can't catch a break here. Ooh. 
Oh. Actually, these spiders, I'm doing okay. Oh, God. Oh, look at that. Ah. Gold. What's this? I have no idea. Let's grab it. Look at the size of those fangs. Look at that. Oh no, this doesn't look good, does it? Oh god. Oh, there's so many of them. Yeah, who'd I get? Who'd I get? Anyone? Okay, okay. Did I get the big one? Oh no, I didn't. Oh god. It's huge! It is, in fact, giant. Yeah, stay right there, you bastard. Come on. Stay right there. Oh, shit. Oh, Breezy buys the farm. Okay. All right. Let's have a look. If we take a look at our loads, what would it do... Let's just go straight into the brood lair rather than back to our quick save, because that was further along. All right, gives you a sense, though. Oh, no, it was this. Was it? Okay, I guess this was. Oh, shit. <laughs> gives you a sense, though, for the how vulnerable Breezy is at this point. One shot from a giant spider is all it takes, so despite the fact that I'm not yet playing at legendary difficulty, we have to be careful. And let's F5 here. My hope is that eventually we'll get to the point where we can play Breezy at legendary difficulty. I think uh, at higher levels, she could be really amazing to play at high difficulties. Oh, crap. Okay, so the... The Wind Rune... is not novice level, so we don't get a free pass on that one. Haha, <laughs> blew it back. Nice. On the ropes, bitch. On the ropes, you big, ugly son of a bitch. Oh, ow. So gross. So gross. All right. That actually worked out great. Blew it back again. There we go. Ah, nice. Ugh. Okay, where is this book? Gods, where's the book? Come on. Book. What? Is that pointing at an egg sack? That can't be it. This. Ah. Well, I don't know what this is, but maybe we can learn something from it. All right. Well, here's the thing, right? I have been around a lot of people who know a lot of things about books. And I'm quite certain that Urag knows his shit. 
so he wouldn't send me here unless he was damn sure it was the right place. So... We just have to trust that our boss knows what the Fluffy's doing. Okay. Ugh. So gross. Wait. Okay. Use your brain, Breezy. It's telling us that it's here, which means it's hidden. What? Is it buried? What is that? Hang on. Aha. Could it be in here? What is this? Okay, all right. Hang on. Let's be smart about this. We bought that for a reason. Get that going. Little muffle. Get that on our list. All right. So, firstly, that is that really wants us to go out that way. That doesn't seem right. So. I wonder, can I dual cast this? Oh, hello. Oh crap, look at this. This can't be good. Is anyone around? We don't see anyone. Suck wind, bitches. Ha! Breezy's here. Ooh. Look at... Oh my god, what are they doing in here? They're eating people in here. Is this it? No. Oh, that's useful, though. Let's take that. Eh, gold's useful, too. Uh... I don't know. Look at these clubs. I mean, it's... not really my style, it's... I mean, it's really goth, right? Not really into that. Although those gloves are cool. <laughs> Uh, are they... Ooh, there's magic on that. Are they cannibals, or...? Oh my god, it's disgusting in here. It smells. It really smells bad in here. Oh, please, let the book be in here. Somewhere, just get me out. And I... do not require a saw. Nor do I need those. Ugh, I'm not touching any food in here.
Okay. All right. Where's the book? Damn it. I should have tried questioning him, right? Wasn't thinking. All right. Where would I hide a book? If I was a cannibal book hider, where would I hide a book? In this chest right here. It's got to be. Oh, oh, Nuts. Nuts! Okay, here it is. This has got to be right. No. No, 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 no. Duh! Oh, I'm running out of lockpicks. This is bad. No, no, no. What is oh, closer. really doesn't want me in here. Did I literally walk right past it? It clearly drew me into this cavern, right? Uh-huh. Okay. All right. Well, if it's not in here, then I must have passed it in the caves earlier. Yep. Look at this poor bastard. Hmm. Poor bastard's got gold. Breezy needs gold, eh? Oh, shit. Okay, back to the drawing board here. All right, if I go this way... It's telling me to go out. All right, let's take a look at this. If we confirm... It clearly brought us in here, and I... Glories and Laments, was that? So if I turn off Shalador's Insights and I switch on... Oh, did I find that? Now it's not on the list. Interesting. Interesting. And I, I don't see that on the list here anymore. So, let's go down here. No. Find copy of Glories and Laments. It's the only thing I've got picked. That is saying go outside. So if I switch that off and I go back to Shalador's Insights only, that has me going out too. What the hell? I didn't find Shalador's Insights, did I? Hang on, hang on. 
Breezy's got to work this out. All right. We got to trust our instincts here. Gotta trust our instincts. So we're gonna go back into the brood lair. We're gonna look again and we'll just leave no egg sac unturned. Disgusting. That chest, we looked in and we left some arrows in there. Okay. It is kind of interesting, right? I mean, I... Son of a bitch. <laughs> Glories and laments. Yeah, that was the one we're looking for here, I guess, huh? Wait, there's a spider egg in here. Should I take it? Yeah. So disgusting. All right, we found it. Why was it in there? I don't want to know why it was in there. But what I like about it is this gives Breezy some perspective. Um, kind of clues her in on the kinds of things that she can expect from Skyrim uh, and the, the lengths to which she's probably going to have to go in order to find the things that she's looking for. So, we eliminated that one, which means all we've got left on the list at the moment is Chalidor's Insights. I don't know where this one is, so we're going to have to go and find out. So let's do that. Oh, shit, it's day. <laughs> Been there for a long time. All right, well. Now. Just trying to figure out the general direction. All right, maybe... Maybe downriver, eh? Good enough. Well, that is going to do it for this episode. Thank you for checking it out. If you'd like to get involved and play along with us, check out unbound.charactercrusade.com for current play rules. You can join the discussion with other players by joining our Discord community at discord.charactercrusade.com. You can find Character Crusade Unbound podcasts on iTunes, YouTube, and Stitcher. Find everything linked from our website at charactercrusade.com as well as a full schedule of upcoming live streams and so forth. Thank you all, and I will catch you in the next episode.